I used to have some jokers days Yeah, I'm trying to figure out five ways to get paid Acting like a menace, boy, you know you ass trade Me and Moco, MVPs, yeah, we see me narrative Get your spin. rest, though, don't overdo it, man Get you some sleep, bro Amazing There is not no swinging issues by as well from... Popping by was fine, but swinging by I don't know how I feel about that game I don't know how I feel about you swinging by Oh, miss this nigga, the family, the YBC do about to get itself indicted, man. Don't do it, bro. Fuck, man. The family made a video about you. You know the feds is about to, they coming, bro. Fuck, man. I know I got to finish them, though. I ain't want them to buy open and take it. Oh, okay, okay. Okay, yeah, get your bread, man. Get your bread, bro. I'm praying for you. I'm praying you get that shit done fast, my nigga. Praying you get that shit done fast. Nobody wins when the family feels. Check it out, bro. You know it's gonna be fire, man. I am focus up. Focus up, man. YBC and then this is a young bad cheeser. Okay. He came. Yeah, see me and I'm the top bull. I'm the top bull of this. So when the indictment come, y'all make sure y'all grab me first. Man, I've been good, bro. I've been good. Thank you for asking, Ryder. I appreciate you. You don't, you know what I'm saying? I know that you don't, that you don't gotta feel like that, bro. I know y'all just coming and being in here every day. Y'all care about a nigga, man. Pre I appreciate you asking. I'm great. I'm blessed with La here. Alhamdulillah. I am blessed. Okay. RPJ. Nigga said they chasing chases. They ain't doing shit to us. Man, RPJ 100. I just want those dudes out there with them tight ass pants on and those dudes. Dude, probably, he probably Yo. was. He ran. He probably ran. Nobody. Hey, yo, dude, if you left I got you outside, right after this. Both of y'all tread mode. I apologize. <laughs> Thank God, Allah. Thank God, Allah, man. I hope you're doing well, too, man. How you doing, Ryder? How's everybody doing, man? Deadly ambush in Port Richmond. A gunman shot and killed a 19-year-old man and wounded a 49-year-old believed to be the teenager's father. The gunman fired through the screen door of their home on the 2900 block of Weichel Street. Police say the gunman also fired at police officers as they pursued him down the street. They arrested the gunman on Monmouth Street. No officers were hit by the gunfire. The surviving victim is in stable condition. How much time you ever jumped out or drove on a drill? <laughs> Never drove. You don't get no participation credit. You a bitch. You don't even drive on his. You a bitch. Nigga, I get participation for real. So ask dude, about, dude, fuck dude, you talk about. Real quick, nigga, dude, ask nigga. Ask nigga right this. Ask nigga. Fuck all that. Fuck all that. It's one mirror. Why did she do on her? They, he I've been good. I'll look. He injured my knee and sparring today. Back. Bet, bet, bet. I'm not saying he a cat rapper. Man, I'm sorry to hear that, bro. That's why I said, man, you need to chill. All that shit is going to do is, like, I, I respect, like, training, but, like, trying to be a fucking boxer and shit as a profession, that shit, I don't think, all you're going to do is fuck your body up, man. For real. When you ever hop out, Wallahi, I've been on drill. In West Philadelphia, we're not talking about the Fresh Prince. Today we're talking about arguably one of the most dangerous. You said I ain't talking about Philly, the fresh prince. According to their district attorney, no, we're one not, alleged member boy. was just added to Philly Most Wanted, and that alone caused friction. Oh in shit! Own. Oh yeah, damn. Something yeah, that. One alleged member was just added to Philly Most Wanted. And yeah. That alone caused friction in their own. It's because he probably already said it earlier. He do be saying it. Cat, which we're allegedly You've been discussed. in here already. But this dude. alleged game, according to local prosecutors, responsible for over already, 30 man. shooting in the past three years for some being fatal. Also, man, me another... too, bro. Me too. Hope everybody get a chance to sit down soon. Person in the group is a young man who rap. A lot of them is rappers, which we'll later discuss. But this young man associate himself with the group, of course. He was recently arrested for a body because he had a dirty gun, which we'll later discuss, according to his homie. Now he was arrested while attending the sentence for another yeah, member who was getting sentenced for three bodies that he confessed to and shooting at the police. You need to focus on editing, course, bro. We'll that ain't discuss. gonna break your knees and your ankles, and you're really good at it, bro. And two of them victims was the wrong target, fam. Then to add insult to injury in this story, this crew really was disassembled by one teenager on one summer night. A teen who was so scared after getting handcuffs, he instantly gave up information on four bodies and never looked back. Now we're gonna nah, that Mir ain't do that. Okay, so Duel, Duel was actually, he wasn't jumping a gun. Damn. Damn. Talk about this alleged game. See exactly where they located, who allegedly Facts. involved you gotta focus the rappers, up on the stop how line. they got arrested, and who on the run. 
Most of all, we shine light and respect for the victims, especially the ones who had nothing to do with nothing. Yo, this and nigga Mayor snitched. Oh, Philly local police I never liked this Mayor is the most anyway. dangerous that game in garbage. Philly right now. So before we go over this one, I want you guys to remember, I don't give you no ain't. I just I give you the story. So with that being said, make sure you like, comment, comment and, and subscribe. subscribe. Y'all make sure y'all sub to my YouTube, man. Say hi to YouTube. Get to it. Young Bag Chasers, also known as YBC, a group that was allegedly founded by a rapper called J100. I think we were just last, I think that was last summer. When we, I think we, that's what, that's what, I, that's the first time I wore this shit. Oh, yeah. When we, when we, 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 we was all blinking this shit out here. Everybody was blinking out here. I don't even dance though. Yeah, you know, you know what blinking is? Shut up, busy. Uh, no. You never heard busy of that shit. You say shit. this every time. TikTok oh, I thought you were talking to me, man. Damn, nigga, I'm over here cussing you out, bro. My bad. Yeah, man, let him make it, bro. This is his first song, bro. Maybe it is ass, bro. Maybe he's saving us from hearing the ass track. My bad for cussing you out. I thought you was talking to me, man. This is what Philly like doing for her. Boom. Boom. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> he about to be this. He's gonna do this Cordy line. Wait, so you was dancing all. <laughs> my bad. I said my bad. Not nah, busy. <laughs> nah, this nigga Ryder got me weak, bro. The block. Yeah, we was out here dancing and shit. And it's a, it used to be the I basketball court right there. I apologize, bro. My bad. Yeah. My like bad. The basketball court not right there. My no bad, reason. baby. I apologize. Oh, Oh, the basketball court right there. Oh, who we just talk about ball with? What's Bear Papa? Yeah, oh, that's yeah, why you can't be doing these interviews. Yeah, we just over there balling. Yeah, niggas got shot. The other side, though. Yo, this, oh, me. The ball this, court this ain't my block, though, but this is my block, too. Okay. Check it out, bro. I am. I'm from 42nd. Like, I am for it, too. Like. I don't even think I got 42nd Street tatted on me, though. Only got all YBC tatted. I got you next time, I'm tell. I'm going to get back to the music got, after this. I got YBC tatted Everybody. three times. Look. I got a, a YBC line, right here. Mm -hmm. YBC, mm -hmm. and then this a young bag chaser. Oh, okay. He oh, okay. Oh, okay. J100. That's how you get him, too. You get a female to come ask all the questions. You snitching, too, nigga. Who started it? J100. Oh, okay. He came right. up with um, J100. No, J100 is a young man who been rapping and putting his crew and people in his song stated back five to seven years ago. And tracks like Turn Up Part 1, with over 100,000 views and counting, released five years ago. But unfortunately for J100, all that dissing would catch up to him after he was gunned down in his neighborhood. Moments after an argument on Instagram Live, the same J100 was shooting a music video. Exactly who and how got his location is still unclear to this day. I'm about to add you to the live, see which one. See if you right, you mean, see if you really want to get active. Because if you really want to get active, I'm going to end this drum, and I'm really going to call you. <laughs> Nigga, right y'all like, tripping and oh, shit. Nigga, never did nothing down here. But he did so much. One of the people who they diss often in they song's mother had decided to celebrate while on Instagram Live with YBC oppositions. Nice to meet you. I think that's goofy, but they killed her son, so I can't even speak on it. They killed her son, but I think this is goofy. I'm not, I'm not gonna be going on live. If anything, if you touch my kids, and we not gonna even knock on wood, hell aloud. Like if you do anything to mine, bro, I'm not gonna be on live talking about it out there with them tight ass pants on and those big ass he probably was he ran he probably ran on you hey yo dude if you lucky if you out of pocket nigga. he probably hid in his boots y'all he probably hid in his boots like seriously like, he's dead on the ground he's bleeding out man hey we got we got a bounty on the hey, song man bed, we got a bounty on the song <laughs> keep deleting my kids <laughs> i'm gonna get my page block. all right i'm gonna be good y'all i'm gonna be good um round of applause clap it up clap it up clap it up clap it up I'm sorry whoever don't like it. I, I don't know them, but you know, they tend to keep a lot of people's names in there. Funerals, they be like Muslim. They, uh, oh wait. Damn, don't get to disrespect him. I'm telling y'all, dual head in them big ass boots with his pit ass head. Son. Yo. <laughs> They said, they said, they said they caught him out there bopping his head. You're he a lost nigga. <laughs> <laughs> the cameraman ain't tell him to duck. Oh no. Nobody, nobody said nothing. To him. I'm trying to open Yeah, my she day. trolling. She said the cameraman didn't tell him to duck. Damn. Rest in peace, J100, though. Damn. Yo, they killed, killed their son, though. Like I said, bro, you can't, I can't, 
I don't, this how she, this how she grieving, I guess. You Other ones me? coming out today, yo. We about to wear J's for 30 days straight, yo. I promise you, we wearing a different pair of J's for 30 days straight. I promise you, say, fuck it. We gonna do 100 days. <laughs> we gonna do 100 days. You, y'all Busy, right chill now, off, bro. chill on, little bro, man. What's up with right. you, man? I've been quiet for way too Take long. Take that $20 days. and get you a chopped cheese and a fucking blunt, man. You wild into that yeah, game. Because all this shit is karma from his men. Every time them niggas speak the all these got some weed. that they don't have shit to do. First of all, y'all niggas chill, not even boy. doing this shit. Y'all claim it. Now, J100 lost his Mom's life in 2003. Fed. But a year prior to that, in 2022, YBC members who rap dropped a song called Dish the Dead with over a million views and count. That video was put on a YouTube page of YBC Duel, the most known rapper out the crew outside of Philly. Yeah, I asked that boy still alive. He could have hit shot. They told me don't dish the dead. I'm like, I can't stop. Bro, buddy. Now, when the video we just watched, Dish the Dead with the YBC members, it seems J100, Reek 1200, and YBC member Yak Yola. Of course, YBC Duel was the people identified in this video. Now, Yak Yola, real name Mark Johnson, Man, within the last week, act. has been put on the Philly Most Wanted list. The alleged YBC member Yak Yola is a man who have a song with the late rapper King Bond called Slide with over 6 million views and counting. Yak Bar, I ain't gonna lie, Paul. Yak Yola is You're tough, wasting I ain't tons lie, of money man. on deodorant. Stop Everybody from YBC was Prince, tough, don't man. Don't actually stop sweat. Deodorants use fragrance. Damn, bro. The reason Mark Johnson, aka Yak Yola, is wanted is for an unsolved shooting that happened four days after Memorial Day in 2023. Sharif King was gunned down on Saturday, July 8, 2023. It was at 2.04 p.m. Philadelphia police officers had responded to the 5200 block of West Jefferson Street and located Sharif. He had been shot multiple times throughout his body. He was rushed to a local medical center where he was pronounced deceased by the medical staff. But at this point, YBC members been getting arrested left to right. The same week Yak Yola went on the most wanted, YBC member Ashad Yo, who is them old niggas at the bottom? The same week Yak Yola went Who the hell is these fucking hypes at the bottom, bro? Two old niggas. Three, there's one over here too. Who is on these? The most wanted, YBC member Ashad Curry was now. getting sentenced for shooting five people and killing three. Plus for shooting at the police. Then he confessed to it, mentioning that Thank two you. of the three was the wrong target. After getting arrested, one of the shootings that Curry had confessed to happened in July 2021. Philadelphia police said the shootings happened at around 12:10 p.m. broad daylight near the corner of North 56 and West Vine Streets in West Philadelphia. The location was just steps away from a daycare center and a charter school. Police said 16-year-old Kaylin Jahad Johnson of East Washington Avenue and 18-year-old Tommy Fraser of North 57th Street were taken to Penn Medical Center where they was pronounced deceased. Johnson was a quarterback for the Boys Latin Charter School football team. He was found with gunshot wounds to the face and body inside his Honda on 56th Street. Fraser yeah, I think one one of them boys was her son. I think the first one they showed. They both rest in so like peace. I said, I, 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 I know she in pain, but Tonight, trolling teenagers, teenagers is crazy still. in broad daylight in West Philadelphia. Today, we're learning mine. more I'm, about I'm the clap. two students who were killed while they were away on their way to play basketball. Not to be Action news reporter internet, Annie man. McCormick is live outside of Boys Latin Charter School. And Annie, we know you spoke with the family of one of the victims. And Rick, we did. And, you know, the students here at Boys Latin are once again grieving the loss of another classmate. Like you said, there were four young men that were in a vehicle that was shot at at 56 and Vine yesterday. Three of them attended Boys Latin and one of them was killed. His name was KJ Johnson. We spoke to his family a short time ago. They say he was excellent at school, excellent at sports and was loved by so many. KJ wasn't murdered because he he threatened somebody. He wasn't murdered because he was in a fight. He he got he murdered. He just hopped or he let he, he gave niggas a ride because someone was just reckless. He gave the thoughtless. wrong niggas a ride, man. Being a good person, and they just don't understand what they took away from us. Rest in peace wrong to him, motion man. from the aunt of one of the latest children Rest in the in city to, to him, die man. from gun violence. The aunt of 16-year-old Kaylin Jahad Johnson, who went by KJ, a boys' Latin student, did not want her face shown, but wanted to be clear: KJ will not be a number. KJ was killed around noon yesterday at 56th it's, uh, and Vine. Shots were fired into his brand new car. Up. KJ just got his driver's license. I just wanted to see what happened. So, what, like, the snitch part, they is going. Like he, they not, 
They said mere snitch. Before Sean got the wanna... YBC Curry quarter pants. Mayor Pat recently took a plea deal on a firearm that was allegedly used in another murder. And after taking that plea, owning ownership to that firearm, it seemed they later charged him with the body, having an active warrant, and seeing oh, him at that shit. court appearance, he instantly got arrested. But see, here's where friction within the group take place. After that arrest, Mayor Pab said is saying, if he knew a body was on that firearm, he damn sure wouldn't take a plea. Alongside go to another man's court appearance. And here's the thing, all that happened around the same time that Yak was put on the FBI Most Wanted for the same body. Now people is accusing Mary Pab of snitching, but that's not been confirmed, so putting that on him ain't right, at least at the time. But of course you already know, fam. People gonna do what they want. Now YBC do yeah, make okay, plenty so statements he didn't, on this. It ain't confirmed. Was I thought he was saying. Swear you know everything. I'm about to shut you the fuck. Stop talking to me, bro. Nigga, Mirror got a fucking warrant for homicide because the day before Curry court date, Mirror had court date for his burner. And you wanna know what Mirror has did? He pled guilty to a homicide weapon. That's why he got a homicide warrant because he pled guilty to a gun that was on the homicide. The fuck, nigga. Yeah. <laughs> now, as far as YBC Curry doing his sentence on the uh, first week of August of 2024, he was sentenced Damn. up to 85 years in prison for his confession and his role in all three. Bodies. Yeah, never plead guilty, even if you no, no contest, man. Plead no contest before you plead guilty, but you always try to fight it, especially if it's something like that where they can fuck you. Man, hell nah, bro, not guilty. You gotta catch a nigga red-handed, man, on camera and all type of shit, bro. I'm still gonna try to plead no contest, man. Top of all that, it wouldn't be to three years later where they find out man. that police arresting an 18 year old for a car theft. They That's had why, no like, clue I be saying a lot of these young niggas don't be knowing what they getting into. You talk a lot of hot shit because you heard about it. You hear other niggas talking hot shit, but you don't know. You don't know what's going on, man. You don't know until y'all ass locked up and these niggas is in your face screaming and shit. Now they got y'all ass telling because all you know is lyrics, nigga. You don't know how that, you don't even know how to live, nigga. Information to solve it for homicides. And nearly disassembling the West going Philly to tell it on everybody. Game, with them not knowing what's going on. It was a warm afternoon in September of 2021 Man, when police spotted a stolen black Audi A6 park on a block in Northeast Philadelphia and watched from afar as the team slid behind the wheel. Just as he drove away, officers surrounded the car and arrested him. He had never had a run-in with police before, and now he was handcuffed inside a major crimes unit facing felony charges. He was panicking. Officers were nearly finished processing him when he blurted out something that seemed almost unbelievable. He had information about four murders. He knew the dates and the approximate locations of each killing. He told police the nicknames of all the shooters. There was Yak, Reek, Murder K, and Totem, Curry and Five too. The officer ears had perked up at this point. They said these were members of the YFA, Young Face Arrangers, and the YBC, Young Bad Chasers. The two so he alive, did tell. This is what I'm trying to get to. Nigga keeps saying, oh, that's wrong for him to just put it. Nigga, did the nigga snitch or not? Nigga, God damn. Shit. Fuck, man. Damn. 20 minutes of yapping. I, oh my god, I apologize, man. Nigga, I'm about to have a fucking aneurysm, bro. Listening to this nigga. He be having too much in between shit. Damn. The team ultimately agreed to Fuck. tell police everything he knew and testified before a grand jury at a public trial, which how they found out in 2024. In exchange, his criminal record for the stolen car would be expunged. Plus, he saw almost four murders. According to his mother, they moved over a thousand miles away. He only come back on special occasions, and that makes her upset. The police detectives had quoted, I never seen a young kid do that. He was crucial. Without him, we wouldn't have anyone. But the obstacles and risks that this young man faced in the aftermath, how his safety was at such risk that he stayed in a hotel under a fake name, went in town for trial, and now lives more than a thousand miles away. Cut off from half of his family, underscores why so many people never do the same. And the assistant district attorney, Sidney Pope, quoted, These kids are bragging in songs about the people they killed. What's one more person than them? And now all eyes on YBC Do, who, according to the prosecutor, oh, he's is the done. leader and making all it's the new That's all they needed, bro, because they've been no more McButtons and McNuggets, man. Fuck. Damon himself as Mr. Disrespect. Now, within the last two weeks, YBC Dude allegedly visited Washington, D.C. He got into a shootout in a Southeast D.C. neighborhood. And then went live about it and told everybody. Except, 
twins. Ain't lost his mick brother. I gotta relate to that. I took a nigga little brother. Oh man, also this known for talents man. like Shot Glizzy, No Savage, Gizwa, and many more. Now around the same time, another local rapper from 37, who was also with YPC Dude, had got reports that he was shot. Only for YPC Dude to allegedly basically confirm this by going to Instagram Live the next day, saying the following: Like Yo. Billy, that shit busting out there. I ain't even gonna lie. I didn't know DC was like that. That shit was busting. That shit trenches out there. Yeah, that shit way trenches and nah, nah. Come on, you can't say that about New York, man. <laughs> I swear on my life, the first ten minutes I was out there, I was in a shootout. Somebody shot. Move back. Shootout. Move Nah, yeah. Imagine yeah, telling there, niggas, bro. and they probably yeah, like, gotta... come on, all they gotta do is be like, oh man, there was these random niggas in ski masks, bro, from with Philly Place probably out here having a shootout, man, who are these niggas? Oh, we know, niggas went live and told us. You got me, no, they don't gotta be safe, they... Now, why does he do end up shooting a music video while in 37 neighborhood, alongside with Young Threat and the cameo? Talking in the very beginning, the song was named Baltimore, where he mentioned he f with the DMV, but somebody from Baltimore just got the bill. Little boys keep getting built to ask somebody go get them help. Shout out to the DMV, but somebody on Baltimore just got the bill. Safe to say, according to the police in Philadelphia, <laughs> twelve YBC shooters or you say both shooters radar, jump right out. Twelve times they As we get out of here, we want to take the last moment That's to say shit. once again, rest in peace to the victims. I love condolences. I wonder, did they? Damn, did they fuck up somebody like that for real in Baltimore? To you guys family This was the this story nigga. Of an alleged dangerous gang Based in Philadelphia That was responsible For over 30 shootings In 3 years Causing some to be fatal A group who was told on By a teenager And results Life synthesis And dead bodies And even conflict Within their own group Fam let me know How you guys feel about this one In the comments Don't forget to like And subscribe And today I'll catch you guys On the next one Calm both McButton twins And he lost his McBrother and they said these people are incels. Not one adult corrects his behavior, but want to cry when they drop. I, uh, I will call it incels because I don't never see these niggas with no females. Z, Z, All Z, these Z. niggas want to do is kill. Hey, did you know you might get a big cash payout if you were in a car accident in the last year? Yeah, that's kind of yep. right there, man. Even if you were that's so much I see, can't believe I really did that. Pay myself for that shit. Now I'm sitting here trying to figure my shit out. Where the fuck my mind at, man? All the time I lost, man, I never get back.